inflation isn't just affecting our groceries and gas, but the overall cost to rent nationwide. Very true. KLBK Skyler Soto looked more into how this is affecting us in Lubbock. Skyler, what did you learn? Well, the price of renting here in Lubbock isn't going down anytime soon, but compared to other parts of the country, you'll still save a good amount of money being a renter here, and we haven't run out of available units yet. I seriously like thought it would be so easy to find an apartment. For Texas Tech student Carly Robertson, doing just that this summer was a lot tougher with a budget like hers. I was living alone, so I wanted somewhere that felt safe as well, and um, somewhere that had where you could bring pets, but it wasn't um, super expensive to deposit or have pet rent. After weeks of searching, Carly finally found a place that wouldn't hurt her pocket too much. The only way I got an apartment was literally that I drove past the complex that I just saw and saw they had a sign and I called. The Lubbock Apartment Association tells us while rental occupancy here is around 90%, there isn't a true shortage that places like LA or Florida are seeing. There's 3,100 units that are vacant and some of those could be, you know, two bedroom, three bedroom. But as expected with inflation, rent across the board is going up and somewhat pricing people out of affordable options like Carly, who says she was looking for something between seven and eight hundred dollars. There was just not many available um, for the time period I was wanting. And the ones that were available were just too expensive. But Noble says most landlords are starting to understand that and still want to meet what renters have on their checklist. A lot of owners are loosening up a bit on their qualifications. So now owners are going down to two months rent or two and a half months rent. And to keep up with demand. 785 new units coming to the Southeast Lubbock. We have 685 new units coming to North University downtown area. And then we, all have, we have 452 new units coming to Southwest Lubbock. Noble says there's people who are coming from Midland, Odessa because the cost of living out there is out of control and are willing to make the commute from Lubbock. Thank you very much, Skylar. Still ahead here at 6. We take a look into the